this is going to be kind of a quick tip and something that uh, pretty much anybody can do and it really will cost you nothing. Now something that I recommend everybody have that wants to make movies is a slate. And a slate, of course, is what you use to mark your, uh, or to sync your audio with your video. If you're using an external recorder, or if you're using two cameras, it gives you a point to, uh, to line up the two shots. These things can be had on eBay. Sometimes you can buy the uh, cheapy ones for about 10 bucks. You can get a better grade of one like this for about 20. Uh, you can get the super duper ones that can cost over a thousand dollars that have the time codes and all that I seriously doubt you're going to need something like that However, you can just go ahead and make one right at home and it'll probably cost you nothing and I bet you've got the materials a Clipboard how hard is that a clipboard and a roll of masking tape. Here's how you do it All right, the first thing we want to do is get our clipboard now this one's made out of the old uh, out of the pressed press board, paper board, whatever they used to call that. And I've got a ton of these that I've picked up over the years. This one's still got stuff from the radio station on it. How about that? But anyway, you know, I'm sure you've got one. And how much can they cost if you have to go and buy one? If you do, go and buy one of the ones in a, uh, in a decent color in plastic, and then you don't even have to go to this next step. The next step, of course, is to take the uh, two-inch paper tape, masking tape, tear a couple strips. They don't have to be perfect. Remember, the audience never sees this stuff in your movie. Or they shouldn't, or you don't know what you're doing. Anyway, we'll take a couple of strips. One of these days I'll tell you about a movie that the slate did find its way into the production. Okay. Now, you put the strips on there. The next thing you want to do is take your dry erase markers. And I bought these at a dollar store. Uh, I believe I got four or five of them for a buck. So, and again, they're pretty cheap. And if you end up using a Sharpie... That's really no problem. You can always just take this tape back off. But let's just say we want to write our scene one. Take one. And then, when we're ready to make our mark, just hold it up. Boom! Mark is made. And if you want to change it, just get yourself a wet paper towel. And since it's a dry erase marker, well, it's not doing the best job in the world. But it does take it off. So you can always write over it again. And again, if you don't like that, the tape comes off. So anyway, like I said, save yourself 20 bucks. Go ahead and grab a clipboard and make yourself a slate. Later on, we're going to be doing some catch-up work because I know it's been a week or so since I've had anything to put on here. Got a new project coming up that I want to talk about and a few shout-outs to some folks that uh, have been awful nice. So uh, without uh, anything else, until next time, as always, you know what to do. Just keep shooting.